Kuronichiwa. Hello. Hey, it's me. That's right, it's me. How goes? You guys are radioactive now. Oh my god. Look at that. Let's go. You're so you're so sparkly. You're iridescent. Amazing! Wow! I never thought that this day would ever come. That's amazing! Whoa! Yeah! Yeah, and, um, well, I hope, you know, you guys are having a good day. You never thought two years would come? Well, yeah, kind of. Because, you know feel like I I felt like this day would never come yeah oh let's see here uh, congrats on 3d crow thank you justice for sing Roni I I'm seeing a lot of things about sing Roni Wait, what's what's with sing Roni it's a little too soon to be saying this, but man, am I excited for more 3D stuff? Your stage is so awesome, and the showcase was really fun. Anyway, it's finally time to listen to the adventures of Japan, Roni. Let's go! Yeah! That, that was... Yeah, I hope you guys like the 3D. Yeah. Uh, your 3D debut was incredible, even if Sing Roni got robbed of the award. But still, we finally have the power of the Rainbow Clocks! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Yeah, and uh, for the poll, uh, it seems that Queen Roni, the Q Roni, has won. Initially, everyone was saying, "Oh, why? Why not? Why not sing Roni? Why?" Sing Roni got robbed again. What do you like about Sing Roni? I mean, I know that Watamama was saying, "Oh, the." The gap moe was cute and whatnot. She's humble. Oh, you like the humble girls, eh? You don't think the MC Roni should have won? I I think it's only fair. Thank you, QB. Thank you. Yeah wanted all of them to win. Well, they're all winners at heart. Because they all got the spotlight they wanted, so... Ah... MC Roni should stay in her lane. Wow. But who got the trophy? MC Roni, obviously. I wonder where they are now. They- they're here. They're here in this room. Just out of out of sight. 
They're they're doing something else um, outside of this room. Uh, maybe shopping. Maybe uh, maybe just chilling. I don't know. Which crony are you? I'm just I'm just crony. Yeah. Thanks, crony, for the 3D performance. I just got my birthday merch. Now I have enough boros neck pillows for each of my crony dockies. Hope you're jealous that all my crony dockies each have their own boros neck pillow. Oh yeah? How many dockies do you have? I think you had quite a bit, actually. But but I have technically three. <laughs> So, <laughs> I have five dockies. Damn. Well, one of the moves. Th that's that's pretty cool, you know. Are you counting yourself as a docky? No, I'm counting cronies. I'm just counting the the crony. You're a docky. I'm not a docky, but you know. I can hug myself. Ish. Ish. And also, I have. You know, if I count Sing Roni, Q Roni, Clean Roni, and Funny Roni, along with my two other dockies and myself, I technically have seven. So, you know, there's that. Whew. No way those all fit on your bed. Yeah, that's why I have some on my couch. I have some on my chair. You know, at my bedside or whatnot. Yeah. All right. However, I should tell you some stories. Story. Where where do I begin? Ugh. Wait. Let's let's go. Let's go back. Way back. From the very beginning. I've been wanting to hear all of them. All right. Well, buckle up. Okay. Okay. So. Let's start. With the airplane. <laughs> the airplane. Initially, I really didn't want to go. Because I was like, how am I gonna stay for so long? I'm gonna have to stay for months. Oh my goodness, how am I gonna survive? And I was low key dreading it, or high key. I don't know. And at Time Family, or like, you okay? And I was just groaning, like, Oh, I don't wanna go! I don't, I don't wanna go! I can't even speak Japanese! What am I supposed to do? Oh! And then... You know... What if I get homesick? There's that too, so... Yeah, anyway... Like... I had to go... I, I took my plane, I was getting nervous, and then... I, uh... Um, was my first time being on premium economy and it was amazing oh it wasn't that amazing but it was like cool because I never I've never been on premium economy before yeah premium economy yeah like premium is like below business class yeah do they have lobster up there? No. So... It's so much better than economy. Um... It's... I don't know. Like... Oh! It was- that, The one thing that was new was that they were giving orange juice or sparkling water like before- before the plane even like took off which was kind of amazing and I, I know, right? They don't offer anything usually. And then there's a water bottle? I was like, whoa! There's a water bottle! <laughs> and then... 
and then they give you like this this menu like um and they ask oh what do you want would you like uh i don't really know what it was would you like salmon or beef but like something a little more fancy like just just a tad bit so it's like oh i'll take salmon and then it came out but in a ceramic plate which was amazing like whoa whoa ceramic <laughs> not 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 plastic it was like ceramic plate it's so fancy right and actual cutlery like metal like metal cutlery which was amazing that sounds so high class right right and then um i guess the seat was uh a, a little teensy bit bigger which was nice and you can also lean back like pretty far and Initially, I was kind of scared to lean back, but then I looked around and everybody was doing the same So I did exactly that and it was so so amazing Yeah, you can you can lean back far It's like whoa Yeah Though, you know, um But in this time the, the company covered for it so um, otherwise, I'll probably just be taking the economy. It was a nice experience. I felt like I was rich. Yeah. And then... Oh, what about the movie? Yeah, the movies! Well, the movies were the same, I think. The same. First class? No, first class is too expensive. <laughs> Oh, thank you, Kage Tonari. Mom dropped by to watch with me, and things got intense. She was rooting for Sing Roni while I had to cheer for Clean Roni. Oh, different, different people to root for. I see, I see. In the end, we agree that Crony deserved it the most. She said, "Small Roni is sweeping next year." Wow, she knows her Crony lore. That's amazing. Yeah. Wow. But um, wait, where was I? Oh yeah, and then I saw the business class right in front of me, and then when they take off, they, like, drape a curtain over that section, so I was like, okay, damn, keep your secrets, I don't care. And I think they have their own washroom, maybe? Um, as for premium economy, we share it with, you know, everyone else. But yeah, like, I was... I was like, you know, th that part's okay, because I'm used to that. Like, this whole thing was new. Ooh, and then and then the little, like, serving tray that pops out, that's pretty higher quality than I expected, too. It was metal instead of plastic. That was cool. I think business class gets a lot more. I, I, I had, like, a bit of a sneak peek, like, over, over at the aisle, and... They had like a really long menu. Like, what do you want? Do you want this? Do you want that? And I think they get their own custom menu or something, which was really fancy looking. Uh, the TVs? I'm not sure, because I got like the very front one. Yeah. Yeah, they got you feeling like a celebrity. But yeah, I'm, I'm nothing. <laughs> But premium economy was super cool. And then I watched movies there. I didn't sleep in the in the plane ride. Uh, I was watching Avatar, Way of Water. And then I watched Spider-Man, Across the Spider-Verse, was it? And then I played Bejeweled, because that's part of my tradition. How long was that flight? It was pretty long. But it's okay. And, uh... Yeah, it was pretty good! I was pleasantly surprised. I, I think I like it a lot more than the first one. Yeah. And... How's the Wi-Fi in business class? 
you have to pay for life, but I didn't, I didn't use it. Also, I didn't need it, so. Uh, but after I landed, I, uh, I was kind of, uh, lost, because I turned on data, but the data wasn't working, so I was relying on the airport Wi-Fi, and I called, um, I called someone up, like, <laughs> through the internet, like, one of my, one of my friends who helped set it up, and I was asking for help, and got it working, fortunately. Otherwise, I would have had to ask, um, my my manager or something to pick me up and I didn't want to do that because I can I can do everything by myself and I did just that I took the train by myself I was so good yeah I, I made a I made a whole list as to what I should say so I took the the whatchamacallit the Shinkansen and I did so good Everything was going smooth. I had like three. No, I didn't have three. I had two suitcases and See during the plane ride it, I, I dressed pretty warm because it's cold there and then the moment when I landed it was so hot I was sweating so much and I couldn't even take off my jacket because I had my hands full was yeah, it was so high. Dang. Yeah. And I was panicking. Well, not as much because I have my data, so it's fine. And then I arrived, and a few hours later, uh, Mane Chan came, and she helped me with um, basic things like, hey, this is the AC. I was like, okay, that's the most important part. Thank you, thank you. And she turned it on for me hours before so that I wouldn't be dead. So, that was good. Yeah. And then got the, got the key and everything. And I was thinking, yeah, yeah. And then for the next few days that, uh, you know, that where where I had some free time, I just kind of stayed in bed. <laughs> yeah, I stayed in bed and I was, I, I brought my Steam Deck and my Switch because I didn't expect myself to be getting out this entire trip. So, I was just playing my game, I was playing, uh, what was it called? East Ward. I just really wanted to finish that game, but it's a pretty long game. I went through maybe two chapters, and then... Yeah. East Ward, how is it? Oh, it's, it's pretty good, I think. It's... E East Ward, yeah. I think I'm on, like, chapter five. Yeah. And I was uh, playing some games and they had a Go XLR, which was nice. So I was using, I was setting that up uh, like later on. It, it sounded pretty scuffed initially, I think you might have heard. And then I was playing around with that a little more later on. Yeah, and then they said it was relatively, you know, like good. You can you can be somewhat loud or something, maybe. So I was like, yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna do karaoke, like while while I'm here, so that I can practice, cause I need to sing a lot. So I was practicing, and then the guy next door was like. I don't know, getting into a fight every day, or doing rock, or something. I don't know, but, you know, as long as he's having a good time, if it's a bad time, I don't know. Yeah, that guy. Yeah, I thought it was maybe fighting, but then the, the, the screaming had... 
how should I say? Rhythm to it? So I'm assuming it's not a fight. Yeah. So anyway, after that, let me cross that out. Um, I went to the kombini because obviously I need to survive aside from the snacks that Monikan gave me. And I went there. And uh, some of the places allowed like self-registers, self-checkouts. And I did exactly that. And I would ask something like, oh, what was it? Oh yeah, before before I came to um, my 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 place, I took the taxi, and I was really shy. I was like, um, sumimase, ano, an ano, and then uh, last time I remember that they they get angry if I go to the right side, but I'm just used to the right side so often, and then. I thought I was on the left side, but I wasn't. Turns out I wasn't, and the, uh, the, the taxi driver got mad at me. Yeah, and I was like, um, I know, sumimase. Yeah, and I, uh, I, I Ubered and everything, so it was fine. I didn't have to say anything else. Um, yeah, he got angry. But it's, it's whatever. And yeah, I, I went just fine. He got angry at me. Like, what was it? Migi, migi ja nakte, hitari desu. It's like, oh, um, machikai mashita, sumimasen. And then it was like, saying nothing. Like, oh, the thank you got e desu ne. Uh, and then nobody responded. Well, not nobody. The, the taxi driver didn't respond, so I was scared. I was like, oh, okay. I should just not talk. And then, uh, yeah. And that, that was the only, only time I came across someone a little more on the grumpy side. The, the, rest, of, the rest of the people were nice. And yeah. And, uh, yeah, anyway, I went to the combini, self-register, self-checkouts, and then there I had my first, first stuff, in a way. Um, like, bakery, it was like bakery bread level, so good. Had all the bakery bread, man, and then they had sushi, they had, like, Sandwiches. Don't, 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 don't. Anyway, uh, they had that, and then they had curry, and uh, that was that was good. I like that. Um, and I got a bunch of other snacks that seemed interesting, so I got that, and then I was able to do a self checkout on that very day, because I'm great like that. And then afterwards, I just stayed home, playing games, either on my uh, Steam, Steam Deck, or just on the computer, maybe. Did I eat a fruit sandwich? Yeah, I had the fruit sandwich, and I got the pudding. I had everything, yeah. self -nichi. Yeah. And then... Uh... What else? What else? Oh yeah, and then it was uh, time for the summer recording. You know, with everyone else, and they got to meet... Um, like, everyone there. I... Th there were so, so many. I, I'm kind of losing sight. Um, that was... Like, Okayu-senpai, and Marine-senpai, uh, Noel-senpai, and then Choku-senpai, Lamy-senpai, and then 
Fauna and Rainy. Yeah. And then when I came in um, to the studio, there's a big wall where everyone does their signature. And uh, the staff. And, and Toa Senpai, right? Thank you. Uh, too many, too many people. It's hard to keep count. And yeah, I uh, I did my signature, which was nice. And uh, yeah, I I try harden and went on a ladder, and I drew the cronies, just just one. But yeah, it was cute, and that was fun. I did that, and then while I was doing that, I. Uh, also met the ID Gen 2 girls. Very cute. I met like Anya and Rene and Ollie. Ollie gave me a really big hug, lifted me off the ground. And I didn't I didn't recognize them at first, because obviously, how would I know? And or like, oh, hi! Or it, well, did they did they say hi? I, I I don't remember. I think they were talking to someone else, and I was just drawing on the wall, and then I went down because I have to greet people, and I didn't know they didn't say anything. So I was like, um, yeah, hi, nice to meet you. Um, and, and I think Ollie said, hey, guess who we are. I was like, um, speak? Can you can you speak a little more? And I recognized who they were by their voices. I was like, um, is that is that like Ollie? Is that Rene? Anya? I was like, oh, oh, hi! So nice to meet you. Yeah. Yeah. Did you get it right on the first guess? Yes, I did! Yeah. And... Uh, I never got any of them wrong. Yeah. And then, you know, was just killing time and then all the JP Senpais came in. And it was cool because, you know, if I don't look at, look at the people, then it just sounds like them. So it, it's it's kind of cool. I'm just I'm just minding my own business, kind of zoning out, cause I I'm just getting ready and just staying still, and I hear their voices, and it's cool, yeah. And they're like eh eh, dot it. <laughs> so we're just like ah, hajimemashite, orokuro ni desu. And then obviously they were being nice, but we're like, eh, eh, kawaii. <laughs> eh, eh. Yeah. And that that was that was very sweet of them. And then they were like, oh uh that they, they tried their best to talk to talk to me in English. They were like, um how 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 are you? <laughs> when Japan So it's like um um like you know around this time Oh Oh nice <laughs> Is that Marine Sampa? Yeah <laughs> It was, it was Marie Senpai. Whoa, how'd you know? Yeah. And then like they were they were all so cute. Wow. And then after they were looking away, um they're like, oh, good. And then she went to uh the other girls, like Lamy Senpai and Choco Senpai, or was it Noel Senpai? Like they they started like huddling. They're like, eh, 
what else what else should i say kind of thing uh, wh what else what else and they were trying to come up with other english words and it was it was funny yeah like ego ego you know kind of like that and it was it was funny and it, it was my first time being in 3d well not really first time but you know first time in a studio testing it out so it was cool and everyone was in their 3d and they win some like sexy poses very sexy poses not not safe for stream yeah and the stream was really fun yeah it was yeah and then it was cool like they they got us lunch and everything snacks nice very nice and the studio was was big, yeah. It was it was big. Surprising. You were so silly. Was I silly? I wasn't so silly. And then, um, like they were they were like eating, and I think, um, oh oh yeah, like we we had a piece of paper and. They were kind of drawing. Yeah. And I was like, oh, oh, can you? <laughs> and I, I kind of like gave my paper because they were doodling on, um, you know, another person. So I was like, oh, oh, what is this? And then they were drawing on mine. And then, uh, Lamy Senpai, like, wrote something like, Oh, my heart goes doki doki when I see you, love. And then, Okayu Senpai and the Marine Senpai and, like, others drew too, which was nice. And I, I was like, oh, how do I, how do I say this? And I used DeepL and said something like, I'm going to give it to my future generations. <laughs> I'm going to have this as a hand me over, like a national treasure. And they were like, don't do that. Yeah. Like a, like a family heirloom. Yeah, like that. Yeah, exactly that. I forget what I said. Yeah. And. It was... it was beautiful. I, I still have it. And then that was done. Yeah. That, that was a good time. And then I passed out. And... And then other times I like to go out by myself. So I did that went to get conveyor belt sushi tried all sorts of different sushi which was an interesting experience I've, tr I've tried like so many other fish that aren't available um overseas because it was just you know tuna salmon and you know just basic stuff right but when I went, they had so many other things, like maybe some some sort of flat fish or uh, like a, a lot, a lot of different stuff. And I was like, oh, I want to try this. I want to try that. And it only came out as like like fifteen hundred yen. So I was like, whoa, that is so cheap. Oh my god. Yeah, I had flounder too. Yeah. Yeah, and th that was really nice. And then went to go. What else did I do? Of course, 
whenever I went outside, I would go to karaoke. And initially, I was kind of shy. Like, um, eto. And then they asked me to fill out some stuff every single time I go to karaoke. It's like, um, but I don't live here. Eto. Watashi. Nihon ni sunde imasen desu kedo denwa bango nai desu. And they were like, oh, then you know, just use your foreign phone number. Uh, I was like, oh, okay. Yeah, you have to register. Yeah. Yeah, you have to like input your phone number. And it was like, I don't live here though. Uh. Yeah, and then uh, always have to order some drinks. I was like, oh, no, me, no, no, um, um. <laughs> and then I would just pick a random tea and then go. And I was obviously struggling with the karaoke machine, kind of confused as to what to do. Like, how do I maximize the, the the karaoke volume? And then, yeah. And then how do I increase the echo and whatnot? It was all in Japanese, yeah. Yeah. You were alone on your first time? Yeah, a lot of times I was alone. And that's okay. Because, like, yeah. Cause I I kind of kind of like hanging out with myself. It's it's nice hanging out with people are good, but sometimes I need some me time. Yeah. So anyway, I will go back on this um, karaoke stuff later, and then yeah, back at the conveyor belt sushi, I was ordering stuff. It's like, mm, I might be hitotsu, onegaishimasu. Uh, or like, you know, um, I can't, I can't remember off the top of my head, but like, Maguro to, ano, Maguro to something something, hitotsu onegaishimasu. And I thought I was doing pretty good. Yeah? Ii ne. Arigato. <laughs> yeah. Um, what, what else? What else did I have? There, there were like so many different stuff and there was an English menu, so I was using that. It's like, eto, maki mo onegaishimasu. And then, and they, they made everything so quickly. I was like, oh, arigatou gozaimasu. Yeah. And it was good. It was good. Yeah. And I felt like I blended in pretty good. Yeah. And let's see. What else? I'm trying to think. Ooh. This, this. Erase this. This, this, this. And that. And then I went to go hang out with Rene and Fauna. And we were uh, doing some looking around, but everything else closed pretty much by the time we uh, got there. So, um, just had curry at Coco's. And yeah. It was good. I back then I didn't set the spicy level, so I just had it plain, and that was pretty good. Yeah, I love cocos. Yeah, it's so great. And then, yeah, and then it was it was cool hanging out with Rainy and Fauna. It was nice. And yeah, we, we just looked around places, which was super nice. Uh, but... And then I went 
I went to Shibuya a lot and Shinjuku too. Oh, hey, Callie. Hey, Deadbeats. Hello. Thank you, thank you. I'm just talking about my time in Japan. Yeah, and I'm gonna talk about you soon too. Don't you worry. Yeah, that we we had some crazy times. Oh my goodness. That that last day especially. Oh my goodness. Oh bow bow. Oh bow bow. Hello, bow bow and deadbeats. Hello. Oh, wow. Uh, what else? What was I saying? Went to Shibuya, Shinjuku, Ikebukuro. Um. Oh, and then I went to go get my nails done. I got yossified. It was super nice and pretty. Uh, though it was kind of a pain because all my stuff. Like, the, the stone jewelry stuff on my nails kept getting caught on my clothes or towels. It's, it's a pain. I didn't like that. Yeah. What nail polish? Um, obviously gel. That lasts better. Yeah. Kelly totally destroyed Fuomoko. Really? Oh, I want to play. I want to play with you. Yeah. But the Yasified nails were kind of a pain, but at least I got complimented for it. Because, yeah, uh, whenever I went to the studio and they got a chance to look at my nails, uh, the the staff would go, hey! Cute! Cute nails! And I would, I would just be like, oh, thank you! <laughs> yeah, the nails lasted for the whole trip, yeah. And then during the plane ride, I took everything off. But anyway, that's not the point. And I went to go hang out with Iris uh, at a butler cafe. I already talked about this briefly, but I didn't understand what was going on. Uh, but it was it was kind of it was kind of interesting, I guess. It's definitely a new experience. Yeah. Uh, back then I said it was a theme cafe. But yeah, it was a butler cafe and um, they came. They were like, oh, was it Ojo sama? Like, I'll, I'll, like, you know, like, if you have your clothes and jacket, you can take it off and we can carry it for you. It's like, oh, okay. And I tried to just sit down and they'd be like, no, dame da Ojo sama. And they would pull the chair and would pretty much say something like you uh, you have to you know you have to let us do the work kind of thing i was like oh okay damn and then all all the menu was in japanese so it's like mm, naruhodo some of them were no, it wasn't. Who am I kidding? But it was in katakana, so I could understand some of them. So... It was like, oh! Oh, yeah! And I just ordered... Um... With the help of Iris Bless. And then I got it. And there was a scone. And I just... How am I supposed to know how to eat a scone is a thing. And I split it apart and like sandwiched it uh, after cutting the scone. And then 
I, I was just eating it because, you know, there's not a lot of jam. I was like, okay, so, you know, might as well eat it like this. And then Butler came over and they were like, oh, <laughs> and I was just saying, yeah, <laughs> what, what was wrong? <laughs> and then, yeah, like, is he, is he judging me? Yeah, he's, he's judging you. And yeah, I, I didn't, I didn't know, I didn't know, man. Like, how do Ojosamas eat their scones? I don't, I don't even know how that works. Yeah. And then I had that... And poor tea. I can't even pour tea by myself. I would have to ring someone up with a bell. Like, ding ding! Like, oh! Ojosama! Um... Uh, what was it? Ota was something something. I was like, ah, oh, hi, onegaishimasu. And they would pour, and then they kick us out after after a certain time limit, like maybe after an hour or so. I'm like, oh, ojo-sama, it's time to go, and pretty much got kicked out. Like, oh, okay. Well, that's- that's that, I guess. And then we went to have, uh, some, you know, I guess there- there was still a bit of time. Uh, so we went to karaoke, we were singing, we are like, YEAH! LET'S GO! And then karaoke was judging how you sing or whatnot. So that was interesting. We both got pretty good points. <laughs> Who won? It's not a competition, man. It's, it's life's not about competition. How does it know? Uh, I guess. I don't. There were like three different categories. Yeah. And then went to go have. Do we? Did we? Oh, went to go have, you know, some food with the girls afterwards, which is nice. And had a good time. Was like drinking. I was drinking mimosa. Sip. Sip, sip. Mm hmm. Yum, yum. Which girls? The, the council wrists. Yeah. Actually, uh. Bay couldn't go that time, but uh, the rest of us, we went and had a good time and then passed out from being so tired. And that's done. Okay, let's erase that. And then... Okay, erase that too. Nice, nice, nice. How long is the notes? Um, it took the entire thing, so I I have to write some more stuff. Uh, yeah, I always get tired as a thing. And then I went to go hang out with a friend. Went to where was it? Was it Kibukuro? I don't remember, but they had a Kirby store, which was so cool, and <laughs> uh, there were, of course, other gachapon places, and um, got that, which was nice and all, but man, there was a Kirby store, which was so awesome, yeah, and uh, like everything else, there were Pokemon, which was cool, I got some stuff. Did I? Not for this trip. Yeah, I was just looking around. There were stuff. It was cool. Great, even. But I was just kind of like, oh, yeah, that's, that's cool, I guess, I suppose. And then a uh, friend showed me some other stuff. And I was like, yeah, that's, that's pretty nice, too. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. 
And then I saw Kirby merch. And they were all so cute. So I was like, oh my god, I have to get everything. Oh my god, I'm going to die if I don't get it. And then I got all of them. All, all, all of them. Well, not like all of them, but yeah, you know what I mean. And then they had this little roulette where you can spin it. And I was able to spin it because I bought enough. And I got all the rare stuff, like little standees, little buttons, and they, they gave me some freebies, like, yeah. And it was, it was nice. I didn't, I didn't get DDD. I got Waddle Dees and Kirby's. It was, it was good. Yeah. And my friend was saying, this is, like, the first time I've seen you this excited. <laughs> all, all day. I mean, I'm not very expressive to begin with. I'm not, yeah, I'm not, like, bursting at the seams. Like, happy, happy-go-lucky, but, yeah. It was still good. Who wouldn't be excited for Kirby stuff? Yeah! And there was a giant Kirby doll too, which is cute! And all their merch stuff, so cute! Man, I love it! Yeah. Yeah. Uh, otherwise, just going through Gotcha stuff, Gotcha Pawn. And, which by the way, for Gotcha Pawn, I got all the stuff that I wanted. Yeah. I had like uh, one out of three. I, I also went to another Gachapon store with Iris, and uh, I was like, "Yeah, I'm going to, I'm going to like, kind of, kind of meditate, kind of remove all desire to uh, want this specific gotcha." And then I got it twice in a row, in fact. Meanwhile, Iris couldn't. So, <laughs> yeah. How much? How much stuff? Ah, uh, just like three. I think I only got. Wait, was it three or four? Maybe four. Maybe I rolled for four. Gotcha. That's how you burn up your gotcha luck for the year, crony. Whatever. It's fine. And then... Uh... Yeah, after... After hanging out... I... Oh yeah, I hung out with Mume too. I think I told you we went to... Uh... A bunch of, like, crane store games and... Like, the machine ate her 500 yen, and I had to call someone over, like, Sumimase, ano, uh, what was it? Kono, uh, ano, Gachapon, koare mashita ke do, um, nani mo, derare nakata. Something like that. Uh, I'm losing all my Japanese. It was it was getting better too. Yeah. Nani mo deraremasen. Oh yeah, it's probably something like that. They we're like, oh okay, and then they gave you know what she wanted, so that was good. It was like, yay, yay. Yeah, I did that several times uh, for her to get an advantage for Gachapon. Well, not Gachapon, Crane Machine. And it was good. Yeah, she, she wanted a uh, Moomin plushie, like little keychain, so uh, she was able to get that one because I asked if they can put it in a good position. Whoa, what did I say? 
。あの、すみません。あー。うん。ムミン、取れば、サンフィン、あ使いましたけど、あの、簡単なポジション、できますかすみません。And then they were like, oh yeah, yeah, いいですよ。And then they did that, and then she got it. I was like, yeah, woohoo. And then, then they was like, oh, I would have never gotten this without you. And I was like, yeah, yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> yeah. And, uh, Just, just did a lot of stuff like that. I was, I was doing pretty fine by myself.、Uh, and then,、uh, what else? Ooh, and then I went to go have yakiniku with Callie, which was awesome. Got to hang out with her. We also had nice tea time. That was nice. I like that. We were just shooting, shooting the shoot. Yeah. And then, yeah, we were, we were, we were, we were partying, man. We were partying. Oh, that was, that, that's all I can say. We were partying, man. Living, living the life. Woo! Party, hearty! Yeah, Callie. Callie opened my eyes to a good, a good time for parties. Give an example. No, I can't. It's. It's it's not. I, I can't. It was just. Did I? <laughs> oh, you're still here? <laughs> you're still here? You're not supposed to be here. Dude, we did nothing on say so. Yeah, we, we, we didn't do anything, you know, on say so. It's just that, you know, we can't say it on stream now, can I? I, I can't really say that on stream as to what I did, you know, what we did, you know? Like, just some drinks and some cheers. Yeah, okay. Actually, that's a very good way. Yeah, we, we drank. We drank. You are so good with words, man. Yeah, we drank. We were having a good time. And I got so drunk. I. Yeah, usually I can't hold in my, uh. Hold in my drink, but I drank so much. Man, Callie's alcohol tolerance is insane. I. I could not think straight. Like. Whoa. Like it was like woozy. Yeah. Yeah, so we didn't do anything illegal. We just drank. We were having a good time. It was a really good time. Yeah. Like, I'd like to, I'd like to do it again. Yeah, and, and we also went to get a massage together, which was super nice. Man, was just you know having having my sweet date with my my sweet sweet girl. She is so sweet, and then was talking about some really messed up stuff like like some movies. Yeah, like what was it? What were we talking about? I mean, I was talking about Balut. I was talking about coconut worms. I was talking about that, and then we, we talked about like other movies. Like, um, what else is there? Like, what was it called? Hell Rider? It was really gory, apparently. I've been meaning to look it up. I forgot. Frick. I want to do my wiki dive. Hellraiser. I think it's that one. Yeah. Hellraiser. Yeah. 
I gotta write it down so that I can do my wiki dive. So Hellraiser, and that was talking about, um, oh yeah, with Pinhead, yeah. And then, also, also Tusk. Yeah, that one was kind of messed up. I remember, I remember seeing, like, the, the wiki for it. That was messed up. Whoa. Yeah. Yeah, that was, that was pretty bad. And then, you dirty wiki diver. No. No, don't say that. I was just doing my own thing. Yeah, but anyway, we were talking about that. I don't know how, but just ended up talking about a lot of, a lot of funny stuff. And I know that she was, or she is really into Baldur's Gate, so I showed her some, some stuff too. Which I thought was pretty good, yeah. No, no, the bear is too typical. So it was something else. How many people- I didn't show the bear. The bear, everyone knows the bear. So it has to be something difficult. Like, diff not difficult. Something different. Yeah, the squid! The squid one! Yeah, the squid! Yeah! Yeah, that- that was... something. I was so horrified. I thought it was some sort of messed up SFM or whatnot. It wasn't. I was surprised that it was legit. Yeah. And then... Was... Doing that. Yeah. Yeah, you can, you can, you can romance anyone. Yeah. It's cool. Anyway, why did I write balut and coconut worm? Get this out of my face. So, that one got Kirby merch, that too. And then. Oh, and then I. After I was done, you, uh, you know how I told you about karaoke, so after that, I kept going to karaoke whenever I had the chance. And I had a lot of chances. So later on, I changed from, Ano, sumimase, um, wakarimase, to, Hi, konbawa. <laughs> and then, oh, you know, here you go, sign some stuff. I was like, Bokarimashita. Arigatou And then, you know, they they got me the number to my room. I was like, yep. Arigatou Took the elevator. And it was just breezing through I I know how to like adjust the mic volume and echo and everything and obviously I know how to register uh, the the songs and whatnot yeah yeah they got an elevator up until like eighth or ninth floor so yeah that was that was nice, and then was punching in karaoke, and then for the first and the last time, I ordered takoyaki, and there's a phone in the karaoke room, so pick that up. I was like, "Hi, ano takoyaki hitotsu, onegaishimasu," and then they're like, "Ah, kashikomurimashita," and then you know, hang up, and then they give me takoyaki, so I'm like, "Yeah, woohoo!" Yeah! Oh. So... Yeah, I was... I was ordering by myself. So good! 
Yeah. And just, yeah, just doing my thing. And I was like, oh, credit card, I'll give you. Thank you. I'll give you a credit card. Ah, yes, thank you. And then, you know, just heading out. Yeah. Yeah, I, so, I sound so confident, right? Yeah, and then I would be asking things like, um, yeah. Like, I would just look things up and be like, Ano, sumimasen, kore arimasu ka? And then they're like, oh, nai desu, or oh, hi, you know. Um, and then they would show me and stuff. And at one point, I got so brave. Cause, like, uh, I got, like, water bottle. Well, I, I got water from the vending machine. And I really, really, really couldn't open it. But it was super hot outside. So if I didn't drink it now, I would have died. So, you know how there's, um, you know, uh, the, the security or the, the guard at the, at the, Ticket station at the subway. So it's like, ano, sumimasen. Ano, henna shitsumon desu ke do, kore, tetsukatte kuremasen ka? And, you know, I would ask for help and they helped me. And I was like, oh, wow, tsuyoi desu ne, arigato gozaimasu. <laughs> Yeah, and I was with, I was with a Japanese person too. I was with a, uh, um, a, you know, a Japanese uh, um, acquaintance. Yes, couldn't really uh, speak. Yeah. We, we couldn't really speak, but we did! We were so good! Yeah. Oh, an acquaintance? You cannot ask the acquaintance? No, because, you know, I don't want to burden anyone else to uh, do my bidding. So, I asked for, you know, both of theirs, because I got hers and mine. And I was like... I'll take care of this. <laughs> yeah. And it was good. I had a good time. Uh, we have overcome the language barrier because we were hanging out. It was good. Talking. And then... Did your manager babysit you? Far from it, bro. I was like going places. And then um also hung out with Bay. We also went to a really nice Yakiniku place and we went rock climbing. Uh yeah. It was nice. Like there's this chalk powder which is kind of like cream, but if you apply it and it dries out, it acts exactly like chalk, which was amazing. Yeah, the, the liquid chalk, that was very cool. But not bungee jumping. No, no. Yeah, maybe one day. Eh, it'd be cool. Uh, I've done, I've done skydiving. I could do bungee jumping if I wanted to, really. Yeah, but I didn't have time to hang out with everyone. If I did, I would have loved to hit up um, Okayu Senpai and uh, Polka, for example, because that would have been really nice. And Okayu Senpai was really nice, and I wanted to hang out with her. So maybe next time. Maybe next time. And then I want to hit up 
Mr. Yago. I wanna have... I wanna have... Lunch. With Yago-san. Mr. Yago. Yeah, I I'm pretty... I'm pretty good with... Um... With... How should I say? With... With... I, I don't... I'm good. I'm good. I don't want to say... It's not... It just... With... With an adult. Yeah. I, I was gonna say something where like... I'm really good with my mom's friends. But... You know... Like... What I mean is that... Like... You know... I'm... I'm good with... Adults. You know? Like, my mom's friends really like me. Yeah. They're... I know how to... talk to them, kind of thing. W w you, you know, within that... age range. <laughs> Not that yago son is old or anything, I'm just saying... Yeah... I'm not, not- not saying he's old or anything. He- Yeah, you know? Yeah. No, he's not old. I'm just saying... That- Oh, I'm butchering my opportunity. Anyway... An an anyway... Um... Not old. Looking very good. You, he, he, he looks very good for his. Not, not even, not even for his age. Like he looks great. He just looks great. He is a great person. He, he, <laughs> he, he's a good person. I, nice. Anyway, um, anyway, really, really good person. Anyway, would love to have lunch later and stuff yup okay so anyway i want to uh you know have lunch and then hang out with okayu senpai and polka which would be nice yeah and then after i i had to go to the studio a lot of times but after my studio stuff was done for realsies uh, this time, I dragged three, three people from management, and it was great. I was, like, gonna, you know, buy drinks for them to thank them for helping me out and stuff. Went to karaoke. It wasn't, it wasn't just... The, the manager stuff. Like, I didn't drag a random manager this time. That was like twice before. This time, I brought three people. And I was asking my manager, like, hey, do you wanna do you wanna come? Do you wanna come to karaoke? And she was like, sure, yeah. And then I noticed uh, some of the other uh, management in in the studio, so I was like, Hey, hey man, do you, do you want to come to karaoke? <laughs> yeah. And then, and then I saw another person entering the scene, like, Hey, hey, so how about it? <laughs> you want to go to karaoke? <laughs> And yeah, so that that one person was like, "I'll go if uh, the the second person you asked is gonna go." And they were like, "Yeah, I'll go." So uh, we all went. It was good. It was a good time. It was drinking. Initially, they want to uh, go home as soon as possible, but I think they were having a good time, so they stayed a little longer. And. That was nice. That was nice. And
and had a good time. And I also ordered the room for them. Like, I, I know, Yoni, onegaishmas. It's gun this. Hi. Arigato zaimas. Yeah. And you know, obviously, they all know how to speak Japanese, but I was like, I can handle this. Yeah. Don't worry. Only one hour? No, 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 you can, you can extend it. Encho, encho dekimasu ka? Sanjupun. Hi, arigato zaimasu. Yeah. And it was, it was good. It was good. And then, um... Oh, what else? Oh yeah, and then I went to hang out with Anya too. Uh, we ate ramen. And then we're just walking around and... We just kind of saw a maid cafe. So... Initially, we were kind of joking, like, <laughs> you want to go to a maid cafe? And then I was like, oh, you actually want to go to a maid cafe? The, oh, oh, oh! And then we just kind of owed all the way into the maid cafe. And we went in, and they were like, ah! And then we, we got seated and and you know we, we got our drinks and Anya wanted more experience and I was kind of thinking initially it was a little lackluster and then they started doing their performance that's where things started heating up because you get to do some gotcha and I got I got basically nothing. I got a random photograph of a girl that wasn't even at the cafe. But... Momo. Yeah, Momo. Momo was super nice. We both really liked Momo and you get to have um, like a custom tip, like a dollar bill. Just specialized only for their cafe and it's like, oh, I want to give this to Momo. But Momo was so popular. And we're just like, we're nothing. We're nothing. She's she's popular. Of course she's not going to notice us. Who am I kidding? And we said things like, oh, I'm so I'm getting parasocial for this girl. I'm starting to understand. Yeah. And uh, what, what else do we say? Oh, yeah, if, if only we can stay here longer. Maybe, maybe Momo, maybe Momo would have known how we actually feel. Ah. Uh, yeah. And it was, it was good. It was... it was good. It was a good time. Yeah. And didn't order an omurice because I was a little too full, but... They are like, ah! Delicious! Delicious! Moi moi kyum! But Japanese sounded a lot more bearable. Because it was like, Oishikuni! Oishikuni! Nare! Oishikuni! Or something. Why, why, you? Yeah. And that that was okay. The food was okay. Yeah. Did the heart thing? I think yeah. And then when we have to call someone over, we have to say nya nya. And that's exactly what we did. And. 
and I had to keep calling the person over for orders. And at one point, I would be asking Anya, like, hey, I've been doing the ordering all this time. I want to see you try it. And then she did. Like, nya nya. <laughs> and I laughed. Yeah, you, you know my pain now. Nya nya, yeah, that's right. Yeah. It, it was nice because I saw a lot of other people suffering. Um, or some people enjoying it. There was this other uh, Japanese uh, person at the cafe and he was really into it. They're like, ah, nya nya, nya nya, yeah. Or um, someone across from, the, uh, from our table. After they said nya nya, they had their hands in their face and was just kind of depressed. And the friend was just watching over him. So yeah, it was it was interesting. And then there was a family who just wanted to experience it. Just uh, so many different vibes in one place. Yeah, I would I would go again. They're so cute! The mates are so cute! Yeah. And I said something like... I want... I want to cringe. Like, if I cringe... For cafes like these, you know that it's a good place. And I am there to cringe, and if I don't get any cringe out of it... Then that means it's not... A good experience because yeah you're going there for cringe yeah and you have to put yourself out there especially if you want a normal experience at the maid cafe you can do that but also if you want to get the best experience then you have to go out of your shell and be embarrassed yeah. And they'll also put their heart out. Real, I know. And then afterwards, I went to Disneyland with Iris, and it was cool because they have this thing called Turtle Talk, and and I think we said something along, along the line of, "Oh, it's a it's a VTuber! Oh my goodness, we get to we get to talk to a VTuber! Oh my goodness!" And we kept pointing at each other whenever uh, he was asking for volunteers, and and I I would see her pointing at me, even though I didn't speak any Japanese. So I would whisper against her ear, like, "I'm." Yeah. And uh, had a had a good time and then uh, there was also like a water ride ish. It it just keeps circling around and yeah, we were like, oh yeah, I'm here to get here to get wet. Oh yeah, I'm gonna get so wet and then we thought it was just gonna be like a simple splash, but there was a waterfall, and we we got like a straight up shower from it. And we were joking around initially before all that, but after getting drenched, we were so horrified. We couldn't even scream. We couldn't say anything. And I said, "Oh, well, and I said that I want to get wet. I mean, like this." <laughs> I, I don't want to get this way. And yeah. But we, we did get cooler, uh, which was nice. And uh, dried eventually. And we got on all the rides, which was nice. We ended up getting all the rides in uh, until last minute, which was nice. Had a lot of fun. The, the what was it the, the the gyoza hot dog was really good yeah i i like that a lot surprisingly we got two each and i 
Paris was like, oh, if I can't finish this, can you help me? And I was like, yeah, yeah, I got you, man. I got you. Yeah, Joe's a hot dog. I don't know, I think I... I think I might eat the most. <laughs> yeah. Out of, out of council rest, really. I don't know, there's... We gotta, we gotta eat. We gotta eat, you gotta eat, man. Ah. But you hardly eat. I mean, when I do, though, I eat a lot. Sure, it's inconsistent, but when I do, I eat. I eat. Yeah. Now, I've been... Uh, this is kind of getting sidetracked, but I've been told before in the past... I think my mom's friend was kind of judging me back then, like, Oh! Mmm, you know, you're not like, how should I say, you're, you're like, mmm, you're not that skinny, you're like, you're like, not, not skinny, and she was kind of judging me, and I was like, oh, whatever, and then she saw me actually eat, and then she was like, oh, yeah, you are. Like, really, really skinny <laughs> compared to the amount you eat. Because, oh my goodness. Whoa. Yeah. Yeah, so she uh, did a did a backtrack and was like, yeah, you're, you're really skinny for what you eat. Oh my goodness. Well, yeah, yeah, thank you. <laughs> she got jealous. Yeah, a lot of people get jealous. Because they, they, they just like, they, they don't understand how I don't gain that much weight in comparison to how much I eat. Just like in my animes. Yeah! Ish! Ish! Yeah. And then, what else? I, I... <laughs> Your gut flexed on her. Yeah, let's go. Yeah, I think I think I'm at a healthy weight. Yeah. E. I hate fast metabolism or yeah, because you're jealous, that's why. And let's see, what else? What else? I was, I was gonna say something else. Oh! And then this other time I was walking around and... Uh, <laughs> uh, I went to get head spa too, which is really nice. And I went to get a massage, uh, which was nice. That was... Uh, yeah. I was... I was joking around with a massage person too. Was saying like, uh, what what I say? Karada, karada, hmm. Just, oh yeah. The the massage person would be asking, oh like you're you're like really like your muscles are really stiff, and like it's pretty bad, man. And I was like, yeah, yeah, it is. Like, katai desu ne. It's like, uh, so desu ka? Like, oh, karada wa ojisan mitai desu ne. Mada, mada wakai desu kedo. Karada wa ojisan desu ne. And then the massage person was like, ojisan ga okore, <laughs> okore masu yo. Okorare masu yo. Yeah. Like, yeah, I was like, oh, my body is kind of like an old man then. And they were like, no. Like, an old man is actually going to get mad at you for saying that. Yeah. 
Yeah, so that was funny. And then they told me, like, Oh, Hatsu wa ii desu ne. And I was like, Oh, so desu ka? Arigato gozaimasu. And then, yeah. Uh, what, are, what, oh, what did I say? Kore mo service desu ka? Yeah, I, I asked if it was、um, part of the service. And, and they were just saying, Mmm, Kamo! Kamo shiremase ne! Ah, Jordan desu! Ha 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 ha
I don't know. Yeah. I, I just walked out and things were good. Didn't a host try to get you into club? I don't even know what a host looks like. I'm guessing the people who try to talk to me are hosts. But I was just going, Iranayas! <laughs> I'm just uh, going, my, going my way, so that was good. Initially, it was just ignoring, but later on, it was it was just just saying that. Yeah. Oh. Uh, yeah. So I had food at the karaoke karaoke con. Yes. Yeah. And I went home. It was good. Yeah, but sometimes I would pass by and then some random people uh, with their friends was like, Eh, saki no onna. I was like, what? Saki no onna? What? what I do? All I did was pass by! And I was getting kind of worrying. Like, what I do? I, all I did was walk! Yeah. You're super famous now. I know. <sighs> Must be because I'm cute or something. Man! Stop it. I mean, I did dress pretty nicely on that day. So, I... No wonder. That makes sense. Yeah. But anyway. It was... It was crazy. I drank a lot at one point too much i can't i can't drink i can't hold my drink i don't know how to hold my drink in yeah uh and as a hangover cure i had some ramen which was nice and then went home and I did something pretty embarrassing while I was dead drunk. I messaged... I messaged some... Some, you know, management. If they wanted to go to karaoke. <laughs> Oh, man. And then I woke up the next day and then I had, like, something similar to- yeah, I had conversational remorse. Yeah, that's what I had. Like, why- why did I do that? Ugh. Don't get drunk, man. I should not get drunk. Yeah. And then, uh, later on, I met up with the ID Gen 3 girls. Uh, yeah, otherwise I wouldn't have any time to meet up with them, so I did. Oh, before that, I did meet Kobo uh, while I was at the studio before this happened, and she was nice. She gave me, um, Hello Me instant instant cup noodles which was nice and then uh she said she wanted to go to the washroom so i was like okay let's go to the washroom then and then uh she was saying hey we should go into the bathroom stall together so i thought she was joking because you know it's in front of management and everything so i was like aha <laughs> You're so funny. Yeah, sure, let's go in. And then we went to the washroom together, and she tried to drag me into the same washroom stall. And I was like, well, what are you doing? And say, it wouldn't, wouldn't it be funny? It's for content. I was like, oh, I mean, I mean, like, you, you want to watch me? Like, 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 how's this, how's this gonna work? She was like, oh, you know, like, imagine, imagine the content. I was like, um, it's okay, I think, I think I'll, 
I go use the other stall. And yeah. And she she was saying, but but you said you'd be in the the same stall together. And yeah, I, I told her oh, I, I thought you were joking. I didn't I didn't mean I didn't think that you'd actually mean it. Yeah, so yeah, we used separate stalls, obviously. It got out. It was nice. Nice nice washroom time. I I don't I I I I idle idle meeting. Idle meeting. Yeah. But very sweet. I liked her. I like her. Yeah. And then and we fast forward. I went to the studio and I saw that Kobo was uh, greeting me out the door, which was nice. And we took the elevator together and we got out. And there were two other people saying, Oh, いらっしゃいませ, or something like that. And I thought, Wow, ID managers are so nice. And they started laughing. I was a little confused and I realized that they were Gen 3 girls. Yeah. And super cute was was like hugging, hugging. Cute, cute, very cute girls. And I brought some snacks over so that they can snack on things while they're at the studio. They already had their own snacks, but I just brought a lot of snacks just in case that they want something. Yeah. And then he's hanging out, talking, asking how they're doing, and um, Kyla was talking about how uh, we, we were talking about hand holding or something like that. Like, oh, are your hands big? And I was like, uh, I mean, if you want to compare, I guess we can compare. And yeah. And I did just that. And she was, she was like, oh, why, why were you so shy during the cooking collab then? And I told her that that's, that's because I didn't see that coming. I didn't see that coming. But this time, I... I can. So... You know. So it did just die, and then... It, it was good, it was chill time, shooting the shoot. And then, after some time, I had to get ready and leave, unfortunately. And I was like, well, I hope you guys are having a great time. Thank you. Thank you for letting me in and wish you luck. Bless, bless. Yeah. And I left and then took the took the plane and it was very painful because um, right behind me there was a Frickin' usually babies, it's okay. I can live. But they were constantly kicking my chair throughout the entire flight. Like never a moment of peace. They just kept kicking and they kept crying throughout the entire thing. I couldn't sleep at all. And I tried to cope by uh, putting on my earphones and then during the last hour they told us to put away the the the, the TV the the monitor and so I had to actually deal with that entire thing for the last hour without anything to block the sound so yeah, I was I was trying to distract myself by, you know, uh, playing Bejeweled while having my earphones on and it was a little tolerable. 
and then they told me to take it off because uh, the plane was gonna land in an hour, so... Yeah... Painful. This is why you fly in first class so you don't have peasants kicking your chair. But that's the thing! It was a premium economy! I thought... And then I realized that premium economy may be great, but not so great. Maybe... Maybe economy is okay too. I guess... I guess it's whatever. One day I would like to try a business class. I think that would be a really cool experience. Yeah, and then that's how I came back. And since then... Oh! Since then, it's been okay. I mean, with the exception of the, the 3D showcase. Uh, but otherwise, it's been good. That's how my trip has been. I've met a lot of people, so many people. And I think it has been a great experience, but also, I believe I am good with social interactions for about a year or two. Yeah. I mean, if there's an opportunity to hang out with people again, that's good. But also, I'm, I'm also okay with not having to interact with people for another year or two. I mean, I, I don't mind. I don't mind. I think I'll still have fun. But I'm also okay. <laughs> I can live with or without it. Yeah. Uh. Yeah, so it's been good. Yeah, now I can chill and play games. I'm excited to play games. And so ends my silly little story. Did you finish any game in Japan? I didn't. I didn't. Yeah. You were chilling and playing games the whole time though. No, I didn't. I didn't. I didn't have time to play more games. Monster Hunter Stories too. Yeah, I was gonna play that one in the plane. But I need a specific monster to get over this part because I need a monster that can climb over vines and I can't catch that thing. I don't know why. Why is it not common? And because of that, I've been stuck for a year or two or more. Yeah. Was there only game time for the first week? Yeah, pretty much for the first few days. Do you need help? No, I'm good. I'm good. Yeah. But otherwise, I've like... Just... Yeah. I've just been going out... At, well, not... I've been... I was going outside... Pretty much once every... One... Like, either every day or once every two days. Yeah. So I went out very frequently. So much grass touching. Insane. Yeah, every day. Yeah.
Good to hear you weren't holed up in your room. Yeah, I wanted to. But I'm also glad that I didn't. I... I may be like a grumbly old fart, but... At the end of the day, I think it was a good experience. Yeah. But at the end of the day, it was tanoshikatta! Yeah! And I got to try all the food at the kombini, which was great. Now I don't have any regrets. I don't have to think, oh man, I wish I could have tried this, or I wish I could have tried that. No regrets. Not, not, not any. Uh-uh. You forgot about the hollow me story. Oh yeah, Kyla. I was saying, oh, I got you hollow me. And I said, oh, thank you. You didn't have to. You, you don't have to. So I'll give you 15. I was like, what? And I didn't have, uh, I didn't have, you know, uh, I, I, I really didn't have like any hands to carry the thing. So I was like, um, is it actually possible? Well, yeah, she, she didn't bring it to the studio. So I was like, um, is it possible for you to, you know, hand it to me, like, um, you know, later at this time, because, you know, we live very close by. And she was like, okay. And then she messaged me. I was like, are you up? Are you up? <laughs> I said, yeah. And then she just dropped it off. And I was like, oh, you're so nice. Oh my gosh, thank you. And then I ran out of space, so I had to ask my... Uh, my dear Chroma, if I can borrow her luggage if she has a spare one. So now I have to bring her luggage back if I ever go back to Japan. Yeah. Because I ran out of space. Yeah, but that was sweet. You stole her luggage. No, I didn't. <coughs> <coughs> yeah. I'm gonna give it back, so that's not stealing. I'm- I'm good. I'm good, don't you worry. I'm so good. Hydration, that's probably a good idea. Uh -huh. <sighs> yeah. Oof. Okay, so with that. I'm gonna be reading the sopas. Thank you, thank you everyone. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You sound tired after all that talking. Yeah, there was a lot of stuff to cover, so. Ugh. Yeah. Ooh. Did you go through the whole list? Yeah, and then I just had to make one up off the uh, but off from the you know off from my head without any notes. An entire luggage of Kirby. Yeah, yeah. How did the Kirby fit? It fit nice and snug, I made sure. Alright, let's see. 
<laughs> so to start us off, to start us off, thank you to Refaction. Where's my Oshi Singaroni? She is in our hearts. She's in there somewhere. Why would you like? Would you like someone more like Singaroni? Shy. And Rice, thank you. <laughs> What's the secret to her singing voice? Hundred solo karaoke's, hundred kidnapping karaoke's. Ooh, walking ten kilometers to the karaoke place every single day. Yeah, you're right. I, I went at least once every week. And top neck gear. Notice something different? Yeah, that's right. I got a haircut. Wow. Congrats. Um, it's amazing. Your hair still looks pretty long. I don't know what you're talking about, but thank you. Maybe it's like a different hair play. But thank you, Yune. Thank you. I'm glad it was fun. The 3D showcase. I did, like, put a lot of effort into it, and I want to do things differently. Mm -mm. And wet taco time. Hi, Crony. It's a little too soon to be saying this, but man, am I excited for more 3D stone. Your stage is so awesome, and the showcase was really fun. And uh, anyway, it's finally time to listen to Adventures of Japan Rony. Let's go! Yay! And uh, Neo Matrix, your 3D debut was incredible. Even if Sing Rony got robbed of the award, also we finally have the power of the Rainbow Clocks. Yeah! Yeah! Yeah. Uh. Yeah, for the 3D showcase, uh, like, mm, like not saying, not saying like, uh, the way, the way it usually goes isn't bad. It's I think is great, and and everything. It's just that I want to do things differently, in that. I wanted it to be more like a show, and yeah, and I think having several, several cronies was kind of an interesting shtick. How much input did you have in your 3D showcase? A lot! A lot! Like... Yeah, a lot. <laughs> yeah, and I'm glad that it was uh, separated into organized segments, and that transition, like into the TV and outside of it, was pretty nice. Yeah. And then, obviously, next time, um, I would like to invite guests and whatnot, but mm, for my 3D, uh, I want to do something. I, I keep saying that, but I want to do something different because I don't think this opportunity is going to happen again. And because of that, I wanted to try something new yeah i think uh it it is it would be obviously great to have people over and i think i'll probably do that for um maybe anniversary maybe birthday so yeah 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 Uh, 
Cloud Dullahan Rain. Thank you. Thank you, thank you. Are you gonna invite us? I did invite you! Didn't you see? At my showcase? And Xenia, thank you, thank you! Good luck with your grass journey. And Norris, thank you. And Sam goes by, but get to in training. Thank you, thank you. And R, thank you. And the bomb. Oh, I saw your expo was super close. Don't call it expo. Um, super close on which crony people thought won. It was interesting to see all of them quite close to each other, which goes to show everyone loves different aspects that make the whole you. Archie be love. Love. And Yayi, thank you. Thank you. And Kay, thank you, thank you. <clears throat> How long do you have to practice till you get the choreography right for a song? Oh, well, you know, I can't dance. <laughs> I know you said don't say I can't dance, but I can't dance, you know. Why'd you say it? Uh, the opportunity was there, you know? It's, it was like... It was, you know, it was whatever. I don't uh, you know, thank you. I mean, it took... Yeah, it took a bit of... Um, you know... A, a recording took a bit, but, you know, it's... Yeah, was, uh, yeah, thank you. I, I, I can't dance though. Uh, thank you. And. I just did so much. And uh, QB, thank you. And Corona. Thanks, Crony, for the 3D performance. I just got my birthday merch. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Lucky you. I wish I had it. Yeah. And you to do it. Yay, rainbow clock. Let's go. Ooh, hoo, hoo, hoo. And you toe. Sing Roni is cute. Other cronies are cute, but you're the cutest. Coolest. How many times must I correct you? Well, thank you. Man, I'm saying. Kuronichiwa, uh, crony. I'm excited to hear your stories, but I do wish you could do this with Callie or other members, then we can hear stories from different angles. The 3D showcase is awesome, and you did an excellent job. I left a rainbow for you to read later. Well, thank you, thank you. Yeah, we'll probably do that. Mm hmm. And Oyachi, thank you. Anero. I have an Aneroni. But thank you, Yachi. And Tate Aniki. Been looking forward to hearing how Japan Part 2 of the 2023 crony anime went for you. Spectacular job on the 3D showcase, by the way. The countless hours trapped inside solitary conf I, I mean, recording booth were worth it. Oh, yeah. I remember. Yeah. Getting shoved into a white room. Soundproof, where nobody can hear my screams. Yeah, that was the time. And uh, Zame, thank you, thank you. And Coach John Mick Guir, thank you. And Waffle Irony, thank you. Oh, you went to Japan? Guess it's time for dinner. No. It, it was too busy. And... Aaron Hong, thank you. What's that cheapest to make but the most expensive to waste? Time. Oh! And... Kage Tonari, congrats on the 3D. The golden cronies were amazing. Uh, mom dropped by to watch with me in 
things got tense. Right, right. Next time, small Roni is sweeping. Yep, yepers. And Zed Griffin, thank you. Thank you. And Bravo, thank you, thank you. And Big the Cat in the Hat, thank you. And Maker's Fries, thank you. And Tate Aniki, thank you. Did you finally beat Monster Hunter Stories 2 Wings of Ruin? No. No. I'll beat it one day. Just not, not now. I don't have time. I don't have time to do it now. Two years, Brony, I know. I brought it along for this trip. I didn't finish it. Uh. And C Square, thank you. Still think about a chicken bento from Lawson. Mm. Just got back from a trip to Japan myself, and Crony, you were so right. Kombini food ruled. Yeah, you get it, man. Their their kombini food is so good, bro. And Azora nine six two. Kuloni, thank you. And uh, Internet Basophil, thank you. Did you try the melon milk with fruit bits in? Yeah, I tried that one. I thought it was just gonna be just melon milk. And then there were weird fruit bits and I was weirded out initially, but it kind of grew on me. I think I kind of liked it in a way. But I got more thirsty after I finished the drink, so... Did you try the asparagus milk? Well, asparagus milk? What? Mm. Mm. But... Thank you to, uh, uh, Tiny SSRB Cloth. Oh. あ、昨日は私の誕生日でした。もしよければ日本語でお祝いできますか？いやあ、お誕生日おめでとう。イエーイ。タイニーSSRBクワーク。いやあ。お誕生日おめでとう。でした。Yay,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,ye,
nice to meet you. Your voice is very nice. I'm glad you enjoy Japan. Yeah. Arigato. Thank you for having me. And Lelouch, thank you. I voted for Crony, but then Crony won. Although Crony also had a great, 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 great performance. Y I I indeed. Yes. It was great. I'm so glad that you voted for Crony. And thank you to Parkoch and Zen Cypher, thank you. And Tradgor. Oh. Smash. Smash Brothers esports tryouts are tomorrow. Oh, Crony wishes Tradgor will be able to win. Crony. Crony believes that Tradgor can get in. Mm -mm -mm. And Gun Cuckoo. Yeah, drinking is pretty fun with friends, huh? I agree. Not you. You drink too much. Be be careful. You 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 need to be careful. Oh, speaking of drinking, I tried Stro Zero. It was pretty good. I got really wasted after that though. That that one can? Whoa! Messed me up so much. Holy moly, I tried the lemon one. Yeah. Oh my goodness, at one point it tasted like like was it acetone? It's wow. But other times it tasted decent, so I'm kinda confused. Yeah. Why are you drinking acetone? I didn't. It just It's complicated. And uh, Kurozora officially saying you can't criticize the drink of cronies now if you know how to get lit late. No, it's uh, it's rare for me. It doesn't happen every day, so I'm still gonna judge. And Kotatsu de Mikan, Kuroni is so kawaii. No, you. Anata wa ichiban. <laughs> and Fong slash Miso. Every time I hang with cronies IRL, I feel like we're alcoholics. But how can you resist celebrating with homies you rarely get to see in person? Um, by having sweets. That's why. And having tea. Tea is good. Uh, JP trip sounds awesome and glad you got to party it up. My Oshi is just like me for real, for real. Yeah. Yeah. No. I keep myself in check somewhat. Sometimes. I, uh. That one time I didn't. That one time I got too late. I got too litty. Yeah, no, not that one. But other times I I held it in. <laughs> How drunk did the mimosa make you? Not much. I had like two or three. Didn't even feel it. And McCree, thank you. And Justin Curry, thank you. And Jax, thank you. And Blake C137, thank you. And Love S, thank you, thank you. And KT, thank you, thank you. And V Faction, crony ordering food. Ahem. When Takoyaki. Itsu Takoyaki. Hello. Konnichiwa. <laughs> uh. Miru, Miru. Thank you, thank you. Kuroni-chan no Nihongo kawaii kute daisuki. Sukkoku jousu datta yo. Nihongo ganbatte kurete arigato. Kuroni-chan ni genki moraeta no de. Oshigoto ganbatte kimasu. Suzuki wa 
アーカイブで見るねうんうんうん、うん、見てよお願いありがとう And run a bar Whoa there crony sounding a bit creepy there What do you mean? I wasn't creepy at all I was being normal It's somewhat normal Cougars 48, thank you. And Great Cronium Connoisseur, thank you, thank you. Oh, wow, interesting. Someone actually fell for the, the tower? That's. Ooh, that's evil. Ooh, ooh, I can't believe that worked. Oh my god. I'm so evil. Oh, I'm so sorry. Oh. I didn't think anyone would actually fall for it. Oh no, I feel bad now. But also. What a schemer I am. That's insane. But also bad. Damn. I'm sorry. Oh. I have mixed feelings. Thank you to Tree at Land, thank you, and Setsuna, thank you, and Rice, thank you, and Kurozora from hanging out with other members slash staff to solo exploring Tokyo. I'm glad to hear about your fun times in Japan. Which area would you say is your favorite? For me, it's likely Shibuya, but I'd say Yokohama if it counts. Um. Oh, I went to Yokohama too, but. Um. I like. I like Osaka too, but that's not Tokyo. Um. I like. I like. I like Shinjuku too. I thought Shinjuku was pretty nice. And let's see. Mr. V, thank you. And Darian, thank you. And Shannon, thank you, thank you. And Gurna, thank you. Uh, did you see the Godzilla in Shinjuku? No. Uh, I saw that. What was it? The 3D billboard thing. That that was pretty cool. The the LED thing. Yeah, that was interesting. The one with the big cat? I don't know, but it was pretty cool. And uh Gurna. Is there any food that came to mind first when you went to Japan? Sushi! Sushi! And it was good! And cheap! I love sushi! And Eric V, thank you! And Wet Taco Time, thank you! It was a very productive trip. Mm -mm. And Agiri, thank you! Mm. Oh, speaking of, didn't know if you forgot, but you haven't really changed the banner like you said before on the anniversary stream. I forgot! Oh my god! I said I want to have that as my banner, but I forgot! Shoot! I mean, if I have like a high quality file. I might change it. I might change it now, actually. Give me a second. Uh, Discord. Can I? Can I? Uh, 
can I? No. Wrong place. Can I get the... Oh, okay. There we go. Done. I have to do it while I still remember. Uh, let's see. Star Mech, thank you. And Sophus, two years of membership. Yeah, yeah. Also really fun hearing you talk about your time in Japan. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Nine breaker, nothing quite like a crony story. Story time stream. Thank you for the stream and for sharing your time in Japan with us. Looking forward to the sequel of this when you get to meet all the other JP senpais like Polka and Okayu. Senpai, yeah! That'd be nice. Number 1729, thank you for sharing your story. Thank you for listening. And Kusuma K, thank you. Would you like to come back to uh, Japan for vacation? Yeah, yeah, that would be cool. Mm -hmm. There's a lot to see in Japan and a lot of good food. So would love to come back. Yeah, and Last but not least, Made in Heaven. Thank you for the stream. Glad you enjoyed your time in Japan. Thank you. Yeah. It was just a lot of recording too, so... Ooh. Yeah. Yeah. Aside from that, it was good. For the membership gift subs, thank you to Mr. Big, New Matrix, Sam Goes by Baguette and Train, eh? All's Just a Fish, thank you. And, uh, Thank Yang, thank you. And Eric V, number 1729, thank you. And Zimki, Encouragement Chuni Alive, uh, Ozora Kuloni. Yuto and Sora F91. Thank you, thank you, everyone. Thank you. Uh, eh. Okay. And with that, I will have to. Oh, the evil with Gahrenye. Thank you! Alright, I'm gonna have to go now, though. It's been good. Thank you, thank you. But I will be seeing you guys very, very soon. Why? You know. You know. Daku, thank you. Do you have to go? Yeah. I kinda have to. But you'll see me tomorrow. You know? You'll see me tomorrow. Cause I ha I'm having a collab with Anya. It's gonna be fun. Mm -mm -mm. Tomorrow? Tomorrow! Okay. Alright, with that, I'm going to bid you guys adieu. What are we playing? <laughs> it's, uh... It's the... whatchamacallit? The creators of Cubescape. I think that should be good. Yeah. Alright, but thank you to all's just a fish. Mayuzumi. 
Oh, you, 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 you. I see what you're doing. Mom Mang, Gravity Penguin, and Jason, the bomb, Daku, and Dark Earth Boros, the servant. Thank you. Right. With that. Bye bye. Bye 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 bye. Kuro yasumi. Yee. Thank you, Yuto. Thank you, Unknown Chair.